Mm. Now, uh, I'm going to ask both of you guys some questions about like some like future fights. But before I get into that, Jay, what was your reaction to the, um, you know, the the Crawford and Spence nah, fight? Nah, I did. Was, and did you, you bet know, on it? I, I actually went for Earl. Um, I, I got a really, I, I didn't, if I was betting on it, I would have bet for Terrence because he got a better arsenal. But I bet with my heart because I fuck with Earl. That's my dog. And don't get me wrong, Bud, my man, too. But I fuck with Earl. You know what I mean? So I kind of stayed back. But if I was, a, if I would have bet, I would have bet Terrence. You know what I'm saying? I was just hoping that Earl really came out there and did what he was doing. But, hey, man, the motherfucker is big. If you know Earl, the motherfucker y'all know, he's a big boy. Making that 47, God damn it, that's hard. And going out there with one of the best motherfuckers with the with the art of this shit to go out there, I would love to see it at 54. Take some time off, get healthy. You feel me? Don't rush that shit. Go back to the drawing board, get sharp, get your uh. And Earl's a guy that just want to go right into it. You know, don't give me no tune up. Don't give me this. Don't give me that. I want right. to go straight for the big boys. And that's cool. But I would like him to really take his time. You feel me? I don't give a fuck. That car accident, all that shit, bro. You a human. It takes a toll. All that shit. I've been in a deadly accident before. So I know it take, It took me years to get back right. You feel me? So, yeah, just take mm-hmm. your time with this shit, man. You, you, still, you still are a big dog in this sport. You still are one of the biggest names. You've been packing and putting asses in the Dallas Cowboys Stadium for years. You still that motherfucker. So take your time and get back to what you want, man. You know what I mean? So I, I think you can do it, and it'll be a better fight at 54. Mm-hmm. So, yeah, let's see what happens, man. What surprised you guys about nothing. Terrence Crawford in this fight? I knew that. Honestly, nothing. Yeah. I, knew going nothing. In, I knew going into the fight that, you know, he had the arsenal that he showed. But um, I just, in my opinion, I just thought that Earl would be able to, you know, Overcome that arsenal with you know his his ability to punch and his ability to wear um Terrence down over time. Even in the chin, the chin didn't impress Man, look, you guys man, at look, all. You guys already knew it. Is, you get anybody, anybody get hit with by the by a motherfucker. You don't get, you ain't gotta be a puncher. Yeah, you, you get, get hit, caught, hit, caught with the right shot. You going yeah, down? Like, yeah. And then then was that's that's two game dogs that was in there, man. Yeah. So it's like you know, yeah. it was gonna happen to somebody. Mm. It's gonna happen at that high level when motherfuckers right. is that that sharp, that on point, that thinking level on that le- on that shit. Man, hell yeah, I ain't surprised. Like that shit can really happen, man. Listen, I only lost at the top of the game to the best of the best. You feel me? Hey man, when you get to that high, that high, that tippity top, everybody's fucking good. Everybody can hit hard. Everybody's sharp. Everybody got the IQ. You exactly. feel me? When you playing in that, when you playing in that ballpark, you never know what the fuck can happen. You can train your ass off for of fucking ten weeks, twelve weeks. Anything can fucking happen. That's your sharp boxing. Yeah. That's that throwback shit right yeah. here. You know? That's that throwback boxing. Mm-hmm. Now, now, Jalil, I remember it was me, you, Coach Kenny, Zab, a whole bunch of people. And we were talking about who got the best jab, and you mentioned you was like, "Hey, I think, I think Terrence might have the the jab on point." And I was one of the key factors, yeah. the key punches in that in that I fight. Let it, I let was it know. Mind you, people know, whole world know Earl, my favorite fighter. I patterned my game after Earl, but I was saying, you know, if it's a if it's a contest based off of them controlling the outside and the jab and and, and, and skill set wise, I thought that was Terrence's game. I thought Earl, you know, Earl get in there and bully him and, and break him down and he could beat him in the later rounds. But you know, yeah, I, I let it be known that he had the he had the better sticks on the jump. Uh, for sure. Hey he got a he got a he got you know it's different jabs. You got up jabs, you got shotgun jabs. He got a wide variety of them. 